Hi everyone, it's Expense and I've got more facts for you. Um, I made a video on this one previously, but it got taken down because of hate speech for some reason. Um, so I'm doing it again. Um, the human body contains um, 120,000 calories roughly. Um, that's if you were to eat one. Um, a blue whale, 1.3 million calories, um, which is the most calorific animal there is on earth. Um, sorry if that offends you. There are colours we can't see. We might think we can see all the colours there are, but there's some we just can't perceive. Um, for instance, can you imagine a yellow blue or a green red? Um, they are out there, but the cones in our eyes can't pick them up. Um, these are those impossible colours. If you're interested to learn more about them, maybe look them up on YouTube. There's way too much information on these to go into in 30 seconds. Um, hold on one second. Um, I'll be back in a jiffy. Did you miss me? A jiffy is actually a unit of time. Um, it's a unit that humans can't actually perceive without help. It is three times 10 to the negative 24 seconds long. This unit was defined by Edward R. Harrison as the time taken for light to travel roughly a distance of a nucleon. The oldest material ever found on Earth is older than our solar system. It's a bit of stardust that was trapped inside a meteorite that had collided with the Earth. Um, this stardust is estimated to be between 4.6 and 7 billion years old, which is actually quite a large range of time in itself. Owls ears are offset on their skull, not just vertically but horizontally as well, so they're kind of skewed slightly. This allows the sound to strike each ear at a slightly different time. Um, this means the owls can pinpoint the source of sound, hopefully tasty prey, a lot more precisely. Humans' ears are not offset, find it hard to pinpoint the sounds vertically, but we can hear it horizontally. It took the creator of the Rubik's Cube, uh no, Rubik's, a month to actually solve the Rubik's Cube after he invented it. The current world record is held by Yusheng Du, and it is 3.47 seconds. That's a lot shorter than a month. Toasting toast is actually a chemical reaction known as the Maillard reaction. Uh, this is where amino acids and reducing sugars react together. This gives a brown colour and a distinctive taste. This also happens in steaks, dumplings and marshmallows, for instance. Anyway, that's today's fact. I'll see you tomorrow for more facts. Bye!